Do you recognize this soundtrack? It is way back then, featured in the Korean drama that has recently gone viral, Squid Game. It is a playful, almost childish tune, which you probably wouldn't expect it to be in this dystopia. Many audiences praise the composer, Chong Jae-in, for their talent of composing such a piece. However, how can they possibly know that this melody is borrowed or even worse, stolen from a Hungarian composer more than 100 years ago? The composer I'm talking about is Béla Bartók. One of the greatest 20th century composers, was also known as the folk song collector. Some background is that he traveled around Hungary and Romania to collect and record hundreds of folk songs sung in small villages. Thus, we may always find his music very raw, almost primitive. Back to Squid Game, which piece exactly did Chong Jae-in copy? The answer is Bartok's 10th piece from 10 easy pieces, Bear Dance. The first most obvious similarity between the two is the melody. Let's have a listen. Let's briefly analyze Bartok's bare dance. The melody starts with three repeated notes which are colored in yellow. Then the yellow motif is repeated with the first note raised by a perfect fourth. I highlighted this alternator yellow motif in orange. Then the orange motif is repeated with an additional pitch at the end which I colored in red. Followed by two notes I colored in green which ends the four bar phrase. The alternated orange motif is played again with an exception of having an upward pink motif here. After that, we have a purple downward motif, which leads to the green motif. The contour, or the direction of the melody, and the rhythm are almost the same. Chong Jae-in just swapped around some bars and did more repetitions. Still don't believe in me? Here I swap Bartos piece to way back then, so you can see how the materials can be found from this piece. First he repeated the yellow motif instead of going to the orange one. Then the alternated orange motif is played instead of going to the green motif, he goes to the pink motif. Next he repeated the two yellow motifs and finally we have something that is his original which I colored in sky blue. He also transposed the melody upward by a minor second or a semitone to make the tonality of the piece to E minor. Unlike Bartok's original piece which is atonal, doesn't have a key center. Chong Jae-in also reduced the complexity by simply repeating this melody over and over again and by removing the complex harmony Bartok used. Now, let's have a listen of Bartok's version way back then. The second thing is less noticeable, is the use of ostinato. In Bartok's piece, you hear these repeating bass notes on the piano, which is played almost throughout the whole piece. Chong Jae-in did almost the same thing but with the percussions, in the rhythm identical to the melody, 3-3-7. With that said, I'm not trying to belittle Chong Jae-in's effort in composing the soundtracks for the Squid Game. He might have been inspired by Bartok for the main melody, yet he did change parts of it to differ it from Bartok. Not to mention that Bartok used only a piano, while Chong Jae-in used an ensemble including recorder, drums, castanet, tuba, triangle, electric guitar, etc. Besides, the middle part did not exist in Bartok's piece. Unfortunately, it is little known by the audience because usually only the first minute of the soundtrack can be recorded by the audience. <coughs> you 
You may also say, Chen Jiayin kind of arranged Bartok's beer dance for an ensemble. If you want more content like this, please subscribe and give a like to this video to support me. Thanks for watching.